stick with you through the tough times. Proverbs 17, verse 17 says, A friend loves at all times, and a brother is born for adversity. Proverbs 18, verse 24, A man who has friends must himself be friendly, but there is a friend who sticks closer than a brother. Proverbs 27, verse 10, Do not forsake your own friend or your father's friend, nor go to your brother's house on the day of your calamity. Better is a neighbor nearby than a brother far away. One of the aspects of friendship that we see brought out here in these verses that we read is that friends are friends, true friends, are those who love you at all times. That means in your moments of greatness in your moments of great achievements they're your friends and when you're down and out when you are at your worst when you are uh, when you failed or when you've made mistakes they're still your friend a friend loves at all times that's a true friend and a brother is born for adversity a true brother is somebody who sticks with you even through life's challenges so these are the kinds of friends we need of course, not all friends and not all kinds of relationships that we have are going to give us people who will stay with us or stick with us through the difficult times. But we need those kinds of people who will be there. And there's nothing wrong in us reaching out uh, to such friends in times of our adversity. Uh, the Bible says there is a friend who sticks closer than a brother. The Bible says, don't forsake your own friend because it's better to have somebody close by to you in your time of calamity than family that are really far away who can't be of any help to you at that moment. So it, it, it means that there's nothing wrong in us going and getting the help we need from such friends uh, in those times of adversity so that they can stand with us, uh, they can help us, they can encourage us, they can support us during those times. Now. We must also learn to be such kinds of friends to others that in their moments of adversity, in their moments of calamity, that we stand with them and provide them the strength they need to help them through those situations in life. But remember this, a true friend is a friend who stands with you through adversity. And you and I, we can be true friends to others and we stand with them in their moments of challenge, in their moments of adversity. Let's have true friends Let's be true friends to others. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for friendships. We thank you for people around us that we can count on, that we know will stand with us through difficult times. And help us to be such kind of friends to others who need us, who need people to stand with them through adversity. And we pray and ask this in Jesus' name. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.